Hi, uh, I just wanted to run through a quick demo of the Lemur 5.0 update that now includes the sequencer objects. Um, <clears throat> with the update, they included a, a template sequencer, which is pretty much your standard, uh, tr your traditional sequencer, uh, step sequencer, with controls uh, for uh, the pitch, octave range, velocity, and uh, the note length. Um, over here you can set the the uh, subdivision of the sequencer to anywhere between 2 to 16 steps. I have it set to 16 steps here. Uh, on the far right you have uh, a control to change the key of the sequencer. Um, right now I have it set to E minor but you could change it to uh, any of your traditional C um, or your, your uh, traditional major minor key scales. Um, and then uh, finally, you got your transport controls to start, reset, and change the, the tempo of the uh, sequencer. Uh, I have my iPad hooked up to my new Korg MS20 kit that I received last week and assembled. Uh, <clears throat> I just have, uh, using my Line 6 MIDI mobilizer connected into the MIDI import. <coughs> Excuse me, of the MS20. <coughs> uh, the sequencer is it's configured, I I guess, to set uh, to send to uh, all MIDI channels. So there was nothing I had to do with the template to get it configured to send on the the MIDI channel that the MS20 is set to receive on, which I actually do not even know what that is currently. So, anyways, uh, let's go ahead and get started. Uh, I put in a I programmed a quick pattern sequence um, for the demo, so go ahead and start it. So uh, there it is, the Lemur 5.0 update step sequencer. Thanks for watching.